everybody knows that there are fairies in the garden. If you just stay still and look long enough in the right places, you're sure to find them. In our garden, there are lots of places for fairies to hide, but I thought I'd give them somewhere special to hang out. All you need is some plants that are just fairy perfect, a nice big pot, potting mix, a few odds and ends, and maybe a bit of help from grown-ups. First off, you need the right spot for your fairy garden. I got Dad to put our big pot in a shady, quiet corner. I drew a little plan of ours. It's really just an idea of what we want to include. So there's going to be a waterfall, a bridge, a little cottage, a tree, and then lots of lovely little plants. Start by filling your pot with potting mix and patting it all down as you go so it doesn't sink. Now we put in the pond for our waterfall. This is where the water comes from and goes to. Then I just put my little low voltage pump in here and run the cord out the back. See how I've put the bucket higher than the soil? That's so dirt and stuff don't wash in. Dad drew this rock for the waterfall for me so the pipes run in here. And once it's going, it should all come out the top like a real little waterfall. Time to put our little plants in. Here's some grassy ones to play and hide in. A tree to lay under and climb. And some beautiful flowers. These are violas and native rock daisies. Dead and close to done. But we still need a few more things yet. I wanted a cottage for my fairy friend, so Dad made this one for me. For the rest of my work, I'm going to get some help from a friend. We need a little stream from the pond. The fabric stops the pebbles from sinking into the potting mix. And of course, a bridge. We bought this one from the aquarium shop. And a little path. Need something like a lawn too. These baby spears are just perfect. So soft. All we need is a bit of mulch. Oh, and a welcome sign. And our fairy garden is open for business. <laughs> what do you think? I reckon our fairy friends will love it. See you next time and happy gardening!